Welcome to my channel, Home With Me, Mrs K. If you guys are new here, hi, it's lovely to have you. And if you guys are one of my usual returning viewers, again, guys, thank you so much for choosing to watch this video with me today. I have got another team you haul, which I am so excited to do again, because again, guys, I've just got some really, really cute items that I am dying to show you. Firstly, before I get into all of the items, let's just get all of the logistics and the information out of the way for you guys. So if you have never ordered from Team U before and this is your first time, it's great that you're here because obviously you guys get to see the products because I know sometimes if you've not ordered from somewhere you know, before and you're not very familiar with it, you can be a little bit skeptical to order. So this video is gonna be great for you. You can see what the products are like, you can see the quality of them. And honestly, I am one of those people, I'm a genuine, honest reviewer. I have ordered from Team U way over 10 times now and every single time I have been very happy with my items nothing's ever been missing nothing's ever been broken my deliveries have always been on time so far I have been very very fortunate and I have just had the best shopping experience with them my mum as well she is literally obsessed with Team U I think my mum probably makes about five orders in a week she loves it that much so honestly you are in absolute safe hands when ordering from Team U. Also, if you've never ordered before, download the app. So if you've never used the app before and this is the first time you wanna download it, this is really good for you. You can take advantage and you can actually use my discount code where you can get up to 100 pounds worth of Team U coupons. I know, amazing. Um, so yeah, all you need to do is just put in the discount code. All of the information as well will be on top of the screen. So I'll put my discount code somewhere in one of these top corners. And also when you get to the very end of the video, if there are any items that you guys really, really like and you want to give them, you know, try them out, give them an order, all you need to do is look at the end of my video down in the description box and then you guys will just see Every single item will be listed there with the links. All you need to do is just click the link. It's really, really simple and it will take you straight to the page and straight to the stuff that you want to order. Also, Team U offer 90 days free returns as well on all kind of deliveries and stuff like that. Um, and yeah, I think that's it. I think that's all of the information that I needed to give you guys so shall we get into what i've got okay so i think i'm going to start with the back to school items that i have been kind of collecting for the kids so if you guys have been with me before you've probably heard me say this a hundred times already but just in case you guys are new to my channel both my two are starting brand new schools in september so i literally have to get them everything from scratch so jessica is starting secondary school so obviously she needs a lot of new school supplies that she just doesn't really need to use in primary school and Jake is also heading off to sixth form so there are some new items that he's going to be needing as well so I have been ordering some really really cute bits from here and honestly the prices are just so affordable all of the prices as well I will kind of pop up into one of the corners on the screen so that you guys know exactly how much everything is so I am going to start with the water bottle so got Jess this new water bottle and I absolutely love the colour of this have a look isn't it stunning it's so lovely and I love how it kind of goes into a second colour I just think that's so unusual and it's just such a pretty colour I think she's going to absolutely love this and it's a thermal one as well so it's lovely and insulated keep your drinks really really cold and also keep your drinks hot if you want to have a hot drink and it is available in a variety of different colours as well but I just thought this colour was so lovely isn't it nice really really nice so she has got her new water bottle so that is that taken care of and then I have just got some more school supplies that she's going to be needing check out the colour of these pencils they are just the most prettiest pink colour and I love them 10 pencils in here which is great because you always need pencils they always lose them or they always break so yeah got her those to go in her pencil case i also got this pencil case for jessica as well because apparently when you go to big school you can't just have a normal pencil case you have to have one that's 
see through as well because all of the teachers need to see what you've got in your pencil case when you're doing like your tests and exams and stuff so i thought i'd get her this one and i do love how it's got that little cute white trim around the edge so yeah i've got her that and then i've got this pencil case as well which is really nice actually i love the color of this one it's kind of like denim fabric but isn't it lovely so you've got a front pocket here this one is really good because it's got a lot of compartments you've got this zip compartment here so you can pop all of your bits and pieces in there without them getting lost and then you've also got this compartment where you can just kind of pop your pens in as well and then you've also got the back bit as well for you to put your rulers and your rubbers and everything but i thought oh that's really good that's really handy you can kind of keep everything organized in there so yeah they've got a new pencil case each um i've got this as well which is a must i've kind of been on the school website as going through the list of stuff that they absolutely need to have what's like a necessity and she needed a geometry set i think they are called so i got her this one it comes in the most cutest little tin and isn't it a lovely color and you have literally got everything in here so you've got like your different shape rulers i don't know what they're called i can't remember i haven't been to school in such a long time and you've got your basic ruler but i love how it all matches in the color and then you've got these little pin bits here and then you've also got your rubber and then you've got your like is it a compass is it called a compass you know the thing that you put your pencil in and you draw a circle and it has the little pencil in there as well which is very handy but i just love how it all fits really lovely in this tin i thought oh she's gonna love that for school nice little quirky thing that is and really really cheap as well it does come in different colours, so you don't have to have the blue. Then I also got these little um, paper clips. Again, such a nice pink colour. I love the colour. You get so many of these as well. And it's really handy that they come in this little box. Because then you don't have to lose them. I thought they might have come in like a little bag. So I'm really happy that they have come in that box. Not only can you use these to like keep all your bits of paper together. But I thought, wouldn't these make a great bookmark? So when you're like in school or you haven't got a bookmark or you might forget your bookmark i know i never had a bookmark i never remembered one and you don't want to lose your page you can just kind of pop this on the top of your page as a little bookmark so yeah, you've got two uses out of those i then got her these super cute little rubbers they did come in a little cute pink packet but i've just taken them out of the packet already to show you guys they're little gummy bears but aren't they adorable in three different colors but i just thought oh she's gonna really love them she loves cute little bits like these so i'm actually gonna put them in her pencil case just so i don't get them lost let's pop them in there okay and then i got jake this new rubber but what i like about this one it's obviously it's quite a big rubber so he's going to get a lot of use out of that and then it has like the little push thing here that's cute that's quirky and again that can just go in his pencil case then i saw this which again is just so adorable i think little girls love cute little kind of novelty things like this don't they this is a pen corrector which is going to come in really really handy especially for school if she's using an ink pen and she makes a mistake and sometimes the schools don't like you to cross it out because they don't like the books to look messy so i thought oh that would be absolutely ideal and it's kind of like a little milk bottle so it kind of looks like a little bottle of banana milk isn't it adorable so so cute she's going to love all these little school bits she really is going to love them um i've got some more school stuff here as well but i'm going to show you these so i got them both a new lunch bag each and i thought oh this year i would go for the same but in two different colors i have checked these out already and i have to say i am really surprised at how well the quality is and also the size it is really like thick there's a lot of space in here guys there really is a lot of space in here i mean i don't think the camera really shows you how kind of big these lunch bags actually are but you can honestly get quite a lot of stuff in there you can even get like a nice little lunch box in there also a drink crisp snack fruit honestly there's just so much room in there and then it says lunch bag down here in the corner which i thought was a cute little touch so i've got jake this navy color so i thought that would go nice with his pencil case and stuff and then for Jess, I just got her this really nice kind of Tiffany kind of greeny blue colour. They did have pink, but I thought, you know what? Girls are just always seem to have pink. And they must get sick of the colour of pink. So I thought, oh, do you know what? I'll go for something 
a little bit different. It's nice and neutral. The pink then isn't too girly or babyish. I thought, yeah, I'd go for this kind of more kind of funky um, greeny colour. I also got this lunchbox, which I absolutely love. And I might even get myself another one for me because I love it that much. Really, really nice kind of beige stone colour, which I think is so nice. I think it just looks really, really cool. I love the sort of plastic bit at the top as well where it says lunch. I just think that's so good. So this is for Jessica as well, for her to take to school. And then on the top bit, you can just pull the little plastic bit off and then you've got your spoon and your fork, which is great for yogurts or pasta. And then you've got the two little sections in here, which is perfect for fruit or crisps. And then obviously your sandwich or pasta or stuff in the other side but isn't it lovely i just think this looks so stylish it's such a cool lunch box and that is going to go so well in this bag i'm going to see if it actually does fit so that we can see how much space we're working with here honestly see look at that fits in there so well and you've still got tons of room in there for you to put all of your other bits and pieces so that's that and then i have these as well i love these right these are folders so i kind of got two for them each and they are just in the most prettiest pastel colors aren't they lovely guys such lovely lovely colors i absolutely love them and these are going to come in so handy for the kids because obviously now because jessica's in primary school she kind of does homework like sheets and stuff but obviously now she's going to go into secondary bless her i mean i don't think she knows what she's in for they're going to be doing essays and coursework and you know stuff like that so she's going to need to kind of keep all of her work really neat and tidy so that's why i thought i'd get her some of these so she's going to have these two colors so the peach color and the lilac color you have the little bit of string here to tie it to keep it all safe and then inside you have these little clear sleeves for you to pop your paper in so like i say all of her homework will just be kept all neat on all of her coursework and everything and you get 30 pockets in there which i think is really great and then for the other two i am going to give those to jake so they're so lovely they would be really nice as well actually oh that's just giving me an idea you know like obviously if you're at work or you've got office space you want to kind of keep all of your paperwork neat and tidy if you're like me, I kind of have a drawer, which is just behind me. I have a bottom drawer where I keep kind of all of my letters and stuff. So hospital letters, appointment letters, bank statements, gas bills, you know, all of that stuff. These would be absolutely great, actually, to keep all of your bits and pieces in, just to keep it nice and tidy. Each one has their own colour. So this could be like full of your utility bills, another one full of your medical stuff. Yeah, it's a good idea, actually, just to keep all of your stuff. I also got this as well for Jess, just a kind of little cute novelty thing for her to put in her school bag. It's just a little miniature hairbrush, but isn't it good? Really, really good. And then you've also got the mirror here as well. So I thought, yeah, she can have this, take it to school when she's doing PE or, you know, if she's doing dancing at school and she wants to come out when she's getting herself dressed, she can just fix her hair. So yeah, I thought that'd be quite cute for her to have in her school bag and just something a little bit different as well, apart from your, you know, your school supplies um i do have two more bits for the school stuff but i am just going to show you these little cute chokers that i have got here oh another thing i will show you do you guys like the top of my hair can you see this plait on the top of my hair do you want to see it <laughs> it's actually a hairband you might remember this from my last team you haul so it's from team you again but how realistic does it look i honestly i had this on the other day and so many people were like commenting on my hair saying how pretty it was and they literally could not believe that it was a headband wouldn't this be lovely for like your bridesmaids if you're having a lovely you know updo and you want to do so like a little plait there oh it looks so lovely on a bridesmaid or even a bride actually it would look really, really lovely. But doesn't it look realistic? You literally cannot tell that it's just not even my own hair. So, yeah, that's also from Team You as well. Right, I've got these chokers. I do love a choker. I don't tend to wear them much in the winter. But now spring is coming and summer is coming, you will pretty much always see me in a choker. I just absolutely 
I love them. And I think when you're just going out and you're wearing something casual, they can really kind of dress up a boring casual outfit. And that's really why I just love to wear them. This one I've got on at the moment is from Team You. I've had this for oh, quite some time now. So these are the new ones. So I've got this one for Jessica, which is the kind of leather fabric one with just a little star here. That's what it will look like when it's on. Isn't it cute? It's lovely. Do you know what? I don't know if I'll give her that. I might keep that for myself. <laughs> so that's that one. And then we've got the heart one. Isn't that beautiful? This would look so lovely with like a nice black dress if you're going out for the evening, wouldn't it? How does that look? Oh, that's really pretty as well, guys. Gosh, have I shaved? Yeah, I've shaved. It's all right. <laughs> so that's that one. And then this is my favourite one, which you're probably thinking, oh, that's a bit boring. But I do love just the plain ones. I absolutely love these. They're my absolute favourite. Look at it when it's on. It's just so lovely. Do you see what I mean? How you can just take this boring tank top, add this choker, and then it just kind of dresses your outfit up just that little bit more i absolutely love these i am probably going to order another one of these and i think another one of these so i will let jess have this one but i do actually like this i thought it'd be quite kiddified which is why i was going to give it to her but i actually like it on so yeah, i'm definitely going to get myself two more of those i'm probably going to go back on the team you up once i finish this video I shouldn't, honestly, I really shouldn't because the amount of stuff that I'm just getting at the moment from there, literally every time the door goes, Simon's like, is that another team you order you've got? I'm like, no. <laughs> honestly, I could just sit on there for hours. They've just got the most loveliest stuff. It's just, oh, it's just like absolute heaven on there for me. I love it. Right, I've got these as well. Now, I have got one of these before. I loved it, so I went and got myself another two so the last one i actually got is in jessica's room at the moment so she's kind of using it for all of her skincare routine and nail varnishes and stuff like that but honestly these are so handy and the price of these is absolutely unbelievable how good are they great for your desk as well desk organizers you could even put it in your bathroom if you wanted to on your bathroom shelf and your bathroom cupboard jewelry you could put like your earrings and stuff in this drawer your necklaces in that drawer and like I say, Jessica's using it for nail varnishes and creams and potions. So you get all these little sections. So you've got the deep two at the back, then you've got the long one here, and then you've got like the two little ones there. You've got the two drawers, and then you've got this flat bit here, which is perfect for like sticky notes. So I do have two of these, but I won't open the other one because obviously it's just the same as this one. The reason I got two is I thought these would be absolutely perfect for the two kids for when they do start back at school i'm gonna get them put them on their desk fill them up with all of their new stationary stuff and then it's there it's on their desk and they've got absolutely everything that they need all in one place and it's just a nice way of keeping your desk nice and tidy and organized so that's why i grabbed two of those but yeah honestly they are really really good um okay let me show you these i love these as well i know i love everything i say that on every video how much i love stuff but i do I love this so much. Get this little wooden tray as well. And then you get the two hand pumps. I freaking love them. These are going to look so good on my sink. Better than putting a boring old washing up liquid bottle on your sink, which I have at the moment. I've got like a, I have got one of these, but it's just a wooden one. It's plain and it's boring. And you can't really tell that there's washing up liquid in it. So I thought, oh, these would be so good it tells you what's on there so this one i'm going to use for my hand wash and then obviously the dishes one will be for the washing up liquid and i just think these are going to look so cute next to my sink aren't they lovely they are plastic as well which is great the kids can use them they're not going to smash anything you don't have to worry about them smashing any glass ones but don't they look good and for the price again i just think they're so cheaply priced for how good they actually look and honestly like i say i'm very honest with my opinion and my reviews and stuff they are just honestly such good quality absolutely fantastic quality got myself another one of these little storage tubs i think so far every single time i've done an order with them one of these have gone into my basket because they're just so handy to have and i have them absolutely everywhere 
around my house. These are great for so many different things. I've got one of these full up with my batteries in the top drawer, ones with screwdrivers in, sellotape, sewing kits, you know, sewing threads, pens, pencils in your top drawer, great for your food cupboards as well. I've got quite a few of these in my food cupboards that just kind of hold porridge sachets, rice sachets, you know, sauces and whatnot. Also as well, great on your dressing table if you just want to kind of put your makeup brushes in. Great for your dressing table drawers. You know, like when you've got drawers, if you want to keep all of your stuff nice and tidy, because you could have one for like, so you could have one for your foundation, one for like your cheek stuff, um, all your other makeup bits, hairbands as well. Great place to put all of your hairbands. And yeah, great for toiletries as well. If you want to just put them in like your bathroom cupboards, put your razors in and stuff like that. This I got as well, which is another wall sticker. You're probably going to think, oh my gosh, she's going to have no more walls left, all these stickers. But I just love these so much. This one says Sweet Dreams, which I just thought was so, so cute. This is going to go probably, I think, I was initially going to put it on the wall above the bed. But now I'm thinking, because I've got quite a tall headboard, I might actually put this on my headboard just to kind of make your bed look less boring. Oh, that would look so lovely on the headboard wouldn't it when you make your bed and then it just says sweet dreams there i thought that'd be so cute right i'm gonna have a sip of my cuppa and then i'm going to show you this because you guys are going to love it isn't it cute it's so good you might be wondering what this is so this is a kind of storage display rack and i think most people that have these probably use it for fruits and vegetables and you know stuff like that i mean look you can even put these tubs on here if you wanted to look and have like your fruit and stuff on here um the reason i got my one is i am planning on doing a key a key i am planning on doing a tea and coffee station in my kitchen you know how a lot of people always have like a hot chocolate station around the christmas period I love my hot chocolate station. I love to do it every single Christmas. But I thought, you know what? It would be lovely to have one of these out permanently in the kitchen and just have like your tea and your coffee stuff on here. So that's the reason why I got this. I am going to show you how I am going to display my stuff just to give you guys a little kind of idea because I do like to kind of display things and show you how you can use stuff. So just for an example, you could put your cups down the bottom or you could put like your tea, coffee and, you know, sugar bits down here in your tea bags. This is my little um, coffee cup, which I also got from Team U. <laughs> this truck is from Team U as well. How gorgeous is this coffee truck, by the way? And look, you even get the little coffee beans bag. So that on the top, like that, how lovely does that look? And I just think that's going to look so lovely in my kitchen. I cannot wait to get all of that done and just set out all into the kitchen. Talking of coffee and tea, also got one of these as well, which is a milk frother. There you go. It does work. It's very good. <laughs> also as well, great for the kids for milkshakes and stuff. But isn't that good? Um got this really pretty tablecloth some of you guys have probably seen this already so this video is going up a little bit late which i know might be a bit confusing because you probably have seen this out already on my table around the easter period but it is just absolutely gorgeous i absolutely love this you've got the really pretty tassels going all the way around the edge and the material is kind of like lace and it's honestly so so lovely as you guys have seen if you have seen my easter videos you would have seen this on my table this is the smaller size as well and it's just honestly such a good size and even if you didn't want to have this like completely all over your table you can also just fold it up like this which is what i did do on one of my tables actually and I made the most gorgeous table runner. And honestly, it looked so, so pretty. But yeah, it's just gorgeous. Look at that. Really, really gorgeous. And also, you might find this a little bit weird, but I have had this on the bottom of my bed. So I've kind of had it as like a little runner on the bottom of my bed. That's where I do the most randomest things I know. Okay, I'm going to show you this because I'm dying to show this to you. I've got this light. This is a neon sign, 
I love these neon signs. You see quite a lot of these. If you go to like some really nice posh cafes or some nice bars, you will always see these neon signs in the back wall. You know, like them kind of cafes that you can go to and you take a lot of pictures for Instagram and stuff. They always have like a really pretty flower backdrop and then they've got one of these like lights on it i've always always wanted one and um, jessica loves them as well so i thought i would get this one for her i'm actually going to stick this away for a birthday present but i know she is going to love this so so much look at it guys so this is what it will look like obviously once the light is off which it looks fine it looks really really nice you've got the clear acrylic bit on the back i don't know if you guys can read that for me because i don't know if my screen is backwards for you guys but it says you're like really pretty now some of you might think oh that sounds a little bit odd like that doesn't sound right if you have seen the movie mean girls it's a very very famous quote from mean girls where one of the girls goes you're like really pretty so it's just like a really really big quote from the mean girls movie which is one of mine and jessica's absolute favorite movies she loves it so so much I thought, oh my god she is gonna absolutely freak out when she sees this and i know she is gonna absolutely love this on her bedroom wall because she's getting to that age now where she likes all of these you know cool quirky things and she wants them all around her room so she is going to absolutely love this and it lights up are you ready for this i've got my plug here i've got everything ready because i've been dying to show this to you okay let's plug her in okay there we go she's plugged in i'm not going to lie to you i didn't know what color this was going to light up i thought oh maybe it's going to be like a a soft warm kind of white color but it's pink which is even better for the mean girls thing so the fact that it's pink i know she's gonna absolutely freak out about but doesn't it look good it just looks so so good oh, i just know she's gonna absolutely love this isn't it pretty i'm thinking about putting this in her room like next to her mirror like her dressing table and then she can also look at this as well when she gets herself ready and it's just like a nice little quote for her to read and i thought yeah this would be so lovely next to her mirror and i know she's gonna love that so much so yeah that is that okay talking of jessica honestly i know it must seem really bad that near enough everything i've got here is for jessica and it seems like i never get anything for jake but because she's just at that age where you can just buy her so much more you, there's not a lot really you can buy a 16 year old boys that they're kind of really into but girls there is just so many things that you can buy girls so i do kind of get a little bit carried away but you guys must be oh my god like is she your favorite child because she's just like the only one i seem to mention <laughs> sounds really really bad but um they are presents so i'm going to be keeping some of this stuff back and using them as presents because i know we are only in what we in april but i have now officially properly started to buy for christmas and i know you're probably thinking oh my gosh Gemma, go away it is April. How are you even thinking about Christmas presents? Yeah, you probably will hear me talking about Christmas quite a lot in this video, so I do apologise. But I always think it's a good idea to just get, even if you just get a couple of things, if you can afford it, and just stick them away. Because honestly, it's going to help you out so much when it does come to Christmas. But how flipping cool are these? You might think the price is a little bit dear, but honestly, £10 for these is super, super cheap, guys. Because honestly... I've tried to find these and I couldn't find them for under 20 quid. And I'm not even joking you. I could not find them for under 20 pounds. Um, this as well. Okay, I have to talk to you about this for a second. Because if there's any mums out there. <laughs> talking about a stressful Christmas. If there's any mums out there with any daughters from the age of eight. I would say above. You have probably seen this print. You have probably heard about this print. And you have probably been asked to get this print in pyjamas or anything that it can come in. Oh my God, the price of it. Honestly, the price of it. I cannot name the company because obviously this is a Timu video that I'm doing and I'm only allowed to talk about Timu. I'm not going to name the company. But there's a very famous company that does this specific print. Obviously, this isn't the genuine print. And for a bag like this, a small bag, I kid you not, $54.00. And if you want a pair of pyjamas, you're looking at around $98, which I think kind of works out around £78 in British money. And I was just like, no, nah, I'm not doing it. However, I was scrolling through the Teamu app, you know, like you do, just scrolling through, adding loads of stuff to my basket. 
up popped this. I was like, oh, honestly, you should have seen me. I was like, oh my God, I'm so excited. I didn't care what it was. I just quickly pressed on it, added it to the basket. Then I realized it was a makeup slash wash bag. Look at that. And honestly, obviously I know it's not the genuine thing. It's not from the genuine place, but to be honest with you, She's 11 years bloody old, and I don't think she's even going to tell the difference, to be honest. I can't tell the difference, you know, and I'm 37 years old, really. And I don't think I would be able to say, yeah, that's not the genuine one. I don't think I'd be able to tell at all. I really, really don't. Um, so, again, she is going to be over the moon with this, which I am, again, going to be saving either for Christmas or her birthday. I'm not 100% sure. I think that was only 2 99 as well. 2 99 I got her this jumper as well, which I am going to stick away for a Christmas present. It says New York. Isn't it lovely? Really, really nice, that jumper. It's nice and thick as well. It's not too thin. It's kind of just nice in the middle, not too see-through either. It's really nice quality, actually. Um, I've got this little lamp as well. This is so cute, guys. You've got to see this. Look at this. It's just, honestly, the cutest little thing ever. Girls are kind of into all of this. Like I said, it's called like preppy stuff at the moment. They're kind of like really loving all of this stuff for their bedrooms. But isn't it cute? So again, I thought I'd grab her that. Stick it that way for her birthday. Just be a nice kind of cute little present. So it is a little lamp. And you do have a little wire in there as well. So I thought that'd be nice. You can put that by her bed for when you want to do reading or something like that. Right, I do have just a couple more little bits here and then i think is that everything right those are the last few bits that i am gonna show you i've got these two little hair bands which are actually going to go in jessica's christmas stocking again i'm just trying to collect all of this sort of preppy looking stuff and they've got like little smiley faces on aren't they cute so they're going to go in her christmas stocking Honestly, I cannot believe we're having this conversation about Christmas presents and Christmas stocking fillers in April. Um, okay, I'm going to show you this. Gosh, no. Here I am saying about Christmas and I've actually got some Christmas pictures here. Guys, please don't leave my channel. Please do not unsubscribe from my channel for this. Please, it just accept my flaws. I've just got a really bad obsession with Christmas. Um, but if you're anything like me and you are obsessed with Christmas and you are a Christmas crazy lady or crazy man please stay with me please do stay with me but i've got to show you these because it's just stunning i'm going to show you the first one well this isn't the first one but i'm going to show you it now i've opened it look at that oh my god how beautiful is that so these are a set of free prints and i love these and the reason i got these is because i absolutely love to do a scandinavian christmas it's just one of my favorite christmas frames absolutely loved these when i saw it and i thought oh my goodness these would look stunning on my wall at christmas time wouldn't they so there's santa in his sleigh and then as you can see it's kind of cut off here so then this is where you would put like your second print so obviously you would leave some sort of a gap so that's the second one. And then you have got the third one as well, which again is the reindeer. It does say stuff on the bottom that says Santa Claus on that one. And then this one says is coming. And then this one to town. So when you do have them all out, it will read Santa Claus is coming to town. But aren't they just the most i have to say these are probably the most stunning christmas prints i have ever come across i just absolutely fell in love with them when i saw them absolute gorgeous they really really are i think these were under 10 quid i'm not 100 percent sure but i'm definitely sure these were under 10 pound they're quite a nice size as well they do come in different sizes so obviously the bigger size you get the more expensive and the smaller size won't be as expensive but they are going to look so lovely in the house at christmas time because this year no don't do it jim don't come on to my christmas right i'm going to keep my christmas theme secret it's april okay i'm going to show you the last few bits here because these are prank items which <laughs> which i have got for halloween <laughs> You guys must hate me. I'm now talking about Halloween. 
Okay, so, oh gosh, I know, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm going to go into this just very, very quickly. So for my kids, I've done this for, oh, since Jake was very, very little. I don't think anyone else out there does this. I literally think I kind of came up with the idea 15 years ago. It's not something I've seen, to be honest. I do my kids a trick or treat box for Christmas. So they get a basket full of treats. So Halloween sweets and, you know, Halloween bits and bobs. And then they also get a box of tricks. So they will have like disgusting tasting, like, you know, jellied sweets that are kind of like all Halloween, but like weird, disgusting flavours. And just, yeah, kind of like trick stuff, basically. Like I said, I don't think anyone else does that. I kind of think it's just something that I made up years and years and years ago. So I was scrolling through the app and I just typed in pranks and I thought, oh, let's see what comes up. So I have got these to put in their prank boxes so this is a pranked bottle of ketchup so obviously you would just hold this walk up to someone press it and then the string would just come out so then the person would obviously think you're squirting the ketchup at them I thought oh yes Jess is gonna absolutely love these and even Jake to be honest because it does, I don't think it matters how old you are who doesn't love to prank someone great for youtubers as well if you like want to do some prank videos so that's the ketchup bottle and then i have also got this car key which i'm going to be honest with you sort the kids i am so excited for this because i can't wait to prank simon i really really can't this is an electric shock key so obviously i'm just going to leave it on the table go out simon pick up the key oh this is my car key we go to press the button <laughs> i'm just going to get a nasty little shock I would demonstrate it, but I'm going to be honest with you, I'm, I'm absolutely terrified. I'm terrified to press it. I know they don't shock you really bad. It is just a small shock, so it's nothing dangerous. It's not going to, you know, kill anybody or give anyone a heart attack. I do need to stress that it's absolutely, completely safe. But I just don't fancy shocking myself. But it looks so realistic. Great idea as well. If you want to do like a little Father's Day bag for your kids, just do like a little prank thing as well. And I also got this as well, which is the same thing as the key, but it's an electric shock pen. I have actually had one of these. I had one of these years ago. There used to be a joke shop down where my parents used to live. And my dad used to take me there like some weekends. And we'd always go in and get like some of the prank things. Do you remember the little box of bangers? We used to bang them in front of people. and like, They used to bang on the floor. I bloody love them as a child. And they used to have one of these pens. And I remember I actually had one of the pens. So like I say, they're not dangerous. It, you're not going to get a massive shock. It's, it's not really going to do much. Just kind of like a little twinge on your hand. But yeah, I can't wait to just prank Simon with these. And again, I've got this one as well to put in a box, which is a lighter. And I think you fill the bottom up with water. Press that and then obviously you're going to get a nice squirt of water when you go to light your fag. Oh, this one's for my mum. I'm going to prank my mum with that one. Oh, my she's watching this video. She'll forget. She'll forget by Halloween. Um, so, yeah, I'm loving those little prank bits. Right, that is it. Oh, that is all of the stuff that I... Hmm, that's all of the stuff that I got. I want to show you more things. I do have another order, though. I do, I do, I do have another order. Um, it is on its way. I don't know when it's going to come yet. I haven't really checked the delivery time, but... I do have another order for you and it is on its way so I cannot wait to show you the bits and pieces that I got from that one as well but what is it guys I have to say if like I said at the beginning of the video if you're kind of you know not sure whether to order from them you know if it's something that you've never kind of ordered from before honestly I, I have to say everything that I've had so far it's just been really really great quality and like I've said everything's always turned up on time I've never had any issues with them at all um but yeah their stuff is really really good really really cheap and like i say in terms of christmas presents birthday presents they have got such cute novelty like unusual stuff that you just don't see in the shop which is the one thing that i love about them more than anything because you can find the most unusual things on there um and just cheaper than everywhere else honestly it's just cheaper than everywhere else um but yeah that is it from me today i hope you've loved seeing all the bits and pieces that i did show you sorry if i have spoken about christmas just a little bit too much i do apologize um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching today's video i would love it as well and i would really really appreciate if you guys would give this video a like if you can because i know if you like a video 
I've been told it can kind of like bump your views up on your videos. No idea if that's true. Um, but yeah, I'd love you guys to give it a little like if you can. And also, I don't ever like to ask people to subscribe. I don't really say it much in my videos, but I would be very, very grateful if you would subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And if you guys have subscribed already and you are still with me, bless you. Thank you so, so much. And I will see you in my next shopping haul video. Take care, guys. I love you all so much. Bye. Mwah.